All right, so this is a weird time for me to be doing this. I'm standing and I'm trying not to bump the table. Yep, and I just did it again. Sorry, guys. Stay. There we go. So my husband was very generous. I saw a $4 grab bag. It's actually a really big box. Let me pull this out in a second here. This is the grab bag bag so it is there we go it is massive so I've cleared off a good chunk of the table stuck it on the end of the table here and now I'm going to see what is in it because I couldn't wait oh my goodness it looks like all Christmassy stuff oh card sock yay card sock okay oh my goodness our place is going to be covered in glitter. Sorry, honey. Okay, so to start off, we got three of these. Very, very glittery Christmas bush by Ashlyn. Normally $15. $15 for these things. Wow. Okay, so I got one two three and just that little bit i am covered in glitter okay i knew i had glitter in here but wow well that's cool a christmas pick i like the mirrors on that it's double sided so it's not just one side got no price on it that is really really cool oh this is Hey, Jingles. So, got another Christmas pick. No price on that one. Oh, another Christmas pick. Oh, he's a cute little snowman. He's a cute little snowman. But yeah, our place is going to be covered in glitter. I apologize now. My husband just walked in to the room. Look at how cute he is. Look at how cute he is. Okay, and, oh, oh, giant arrangement, wow, I don't know, yeah, I got the whole thing in, this is normally $70, wow, just wow, okay, thank you for clearing most of the table, honey. You're welcome. Okay. Ooh. It's covered in <laughs> glitter and stuff. All right. So we got some ribbon. Some really cool glittery ribbon. Normally $5. And this is what I'm excited about. This is why the thing was so heavy cardstock. This I can use for book binding and bookmaking. Ta-da! Red cardstock! So I've got one. Let me set those over here. I'm trying to get as much of the fake snow and glitter off of it. Like, look at that. Two. Three. Hey, I have no idea if there's somebody. It looks like somebody might be on here. Hello. I don't see any chats or anything, so sorry if you're chatting me. All right, so that's one, two, three, four, five. Glitter. Glitter. And six. Hello! Oh, good! Hello, sweetie! I can see your chats. That's awesome. So that's all of them. So I've got one, two, three, four, five. I got six of these things. Yay for cardstock! Now I have to figure out what to do with these. So that's the entire box. <coughs> but holy cow! Like, I got a $70 arrangement, so let me recap, because I think you just came in. 
So I got six of these things. Yeah, just remove the glitter bomb. Thank you, honey. I got $5 super glitter thing of ribbon. I got a couple picks, some Christmas picks. This one makes noise. Slice of fun. I love how shiny this is. It's got a lot of weight to it, too. I love how it just glistens. And this guy is an absolute cutie. It's fun. Oh, and he is normally $6. So I'm assuming all the other ones are probably $6. And this is where the glitter bomb came from. These guys. They're covered in white fake snow glitter. And just everywhere. And these normally were $15. I got three of these. Yep, table's officially covered. Ooh, we're gonna have to do some good cleaning before we craft. And then the last thing that was in there, yes, this whole box was $4. Um, they do this every once in a while. They have some leftover clearance for seasonal items. They usually do $4 grab bags, which I've done before and gotten like scrapbook papers and different things, but I've never seen a $4 grab box. This was a huge, big box. And the main reason it was a big box was because of this. See, can you get yeah I got the whole thing in this is normally a $70 floral arrangement so yeah I think that's pretty cool here's the top of it you can it's got some fruits in it and some yellow flowers and then I got all of these cranberry cardstock which is super cool because I do like I said I don't do a lot of card making but I do a lot of book binding so I'll be doing some probably tearaway pads, um, some different book binding projects. Uh, I'll have to think because now these are 50 each and I have six of them. So I have to come up with some good ideas. So if you have any ideas, leave them down below when I'm done here. Oh, hey. Oh, my goodness. I did not know that. How are you? That's great. Thank you for joining me. I've never actually had someone join me on in, uh, from Instagram or even anybody join me for a live stream. So that's so cool. Hi. Um, so cool. I didn't really have anything else. I was just going to do the quick grab bag. Um, I will do it since you're on here. Show you guys my purchase. Oh, I'm shaking the camera like mad. But... I just got some, it's not super interesting, but it is to me, some Liquitex Matte Medium. Uh, I recently saw a, uh, like, um, a mixed media class where she did a photo transfer using Matte Medium. And I thought that was really cool. Where she laid down the Matte Medium, put down the picture, laid down the Matte Medium, let it dry, and then she used... A wet wipe and very carefully went over it and the white paper peeled away uh, and left just the image from a printed image from her computer so not a photograph but a printed image from the printer so I thought that was kind of cool and I wanted to try it so I got another it's just a matte medium fluid medium by Liquitex she said any matte medium should work so hopefully it will but yeah so that's all I was going to share. Just a really quick one. Thanks so much for watching and thank you for joining. I'm so glad you got to see me live. That's weird and cool. I love it. First time ever. I'm such a nerd and geeking out. But I will see you guys around. Have a fabulous Friday evening and a great weekend. Bye, everybody. Oh, good. I'm glad you've seen that. Good, good. All right. Well, I'm going to take off.